I will play Cullen Bay. It's a 5-4 march for pipe band, and uh, I'll play a snare drum setting that I like. Find a piper so that you know what the melody sounds like, and here's Cullen Bay. That's 88 beats per minute. I have a metronome here in my pocket and an earphone in my ear. That's 88. Uh, there are five beats in every measure of music. And uh, I think it's important to make the most of every accent. Try to make them as distinct as possible. For example, I'll play the first two bars again. Here we go. And like this. That last roll that I played, or series of rolls, uh, could sound just monotone and messy if I didn't play it with accents. Listen to this. Now listen to this. I find that that has a melody, and the first edition of that, or the first example, uh, was more vanilla. Sorry. As opposed to. Right? Which one do you prefer? I like the accented version. Uh, and let's make the most of the crescendos throughout the piece. So here's the lift again. Into the next pattern. Um, as well as uh, crescendos in the last pattern, the fourth of the, uh, of the series here. Those accents in the 30-second 30, the 30 notes are very cool. Those crescendos. Oh. Uh, so let me slow it down here to 72. I'll play it again. Cullen Bay, 72 beats per minute. Thank you. Of course, there are many ways to interpret this and uh, many ways to add nuance and your own inflection and your own style. Listen to many versions of this if possible. Uh, this is just the way that I've learned it and practiced it. Thanks for watching.